outside on my balcony, enjoying the fresh morning air before it gets too hot to be out here. Um, I'm listening to my live lecture. So the influence of vaccine. And I'm cooking some biscuits and gravy. Up right now I haven't really figured out how to film in the car yet I kind of just found a random spot and I hope it'll stay I am filming this way because I'm currently on my way to skills class but today I just thought I could do a little day in my life day in the life of a nursing student um, an online nursing student well partially online I guess today is kind of like a hybrid day because I do get to go into the skills lab and it's just, it is just a partial day because I forgot to film this morning. I've already had most of my morning. It is currently 1.40 ish, I don't know. My clock in my car is <laughs> really wrong, so I'm just guessing it's maybe 1.40. So yeah, I've already had a morning <laughs> of studying. I had a live engagement this morning, which is basically like a virtual online lecture that we all log into and we get to ask questions. Um, it's live, that's what it means. I just <laughs> rushed out of the shower. My hair is so wet, I hope it dries um, before I have to go into skills because then I have to put my hair up and then it's gonna be all crinkled and not a good look. But today we are going over NG2 placement, which I'm super excited about. I don't know exactly how this skills lab is gonna go. I don't know. I mean, we'll obviously be placing them on dummies. We don't get that real life experience this semester, sadly, like I've talked about before. But it'll be super interesting to uh, have a new skill under my belt. I'm shutting like crazy because I just showered. It's an issue. Comment down below if everyone's hair like falls out an insane amount after the shower. Like mine just like does not stop shedding for like the whole day after I've showered. It's kind of annoying. Na -na 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 -na. I also have low fuel. Great. Great to hear. Love to hear it. Am I gonna make it to campus? I don't know. Also, my allergies have been horrible, which in the time we're in, not a great time to be sniffling, not a great time to have allergies and sound like this. Um, everyone just looks at you like you're sick. And uh, This week, I had to work yesterday all day. I got home at like 7.15 and I just went into all of my online homework stuff that I had to do for today, that had to be done for today for our lecture and for our skills today. So I got all of that done and then this morning, I listened to live engagement. Not gonna lie, I fell asleep for the last 30 minutes. Not my proudest moment, but I did get up at 6.30 and I went to bed at like past midnight last night. So I wasn't really running on that many hours of sleep. Um, so I did take a little nap. We were talking about seizure precautions though, which I feel like I know. So I'm not too worried about that and it's recorded so I can go back. Yeah, so I listened to lecture this morning. I was up doing homework. I have two different projects due this week for clinical. So I got one of those done. I have a paper I have to write, um, which I haven't started. So I need to do that after skills. Um, but I'm kind of thinking that that's the schedule I want to stay on so getting a bunch of stuff done after work on Wednesday that is going to be due today like this morning and then I will try to wake up early have a productive morning which is what I did today um, normally I'm not successful in that I'm not a morning person whatsoever at all a hundred percent a hundred and ten percent 
not a morning person whatsoever. The only reason I was able to get up this morning was because my boyfriend was getting up early for work and he went and got Dunkin' for me, Dunkin' Donuts. So, so I got coffee to get me out of bed this morning, which was amazing. Best boyfriend ever. Um, I don't have that every morning. So I'm gonna have to figure out another way to get my lazy ass out of bed. Yeah, so I wanna try to wake up early. I wanna try to force myself to be a morning person. I know it's doable. Fixing my sleep schedule so that I can be productive. The morning just has like a certain kind of peace to it, I feel like. Just hanging out in the morning about it, just like, not a lot of people, like, but all that's quiet. I don't know, I felt really at peace this morning. I had my dunking. Um, I put on the morning news, like, morning air in because it's getting really really nice and cool in the mornings um, still during the day not so much it's uh, 90 degrees right now not a fan um, it's like almost the end of October and we still have <laughs> the heat and I want to wear my sweaters so bad like so bad I love sweater weather I love fall outfits fall styling. I don't know, I'm really excited for that and this uh, Arizona weather is just not giving it to me and I'm really upset about it. But yeah, I'm almost to campus. If I, uh, if my skills instructor hasn't texted us to head on into skills lab, then I can film again, I can record again and pull out in front of you and you're like there's literally no one behind me like there's no one behind me why can't you just wait for me to pass instead of making me slam on my brakes okay um, so I just got to campus um, I still have not received a text from my skills instructor saying that we can come in so I'm just gonna hang out here in the air conditioning for a little bit because once I go in there I have to stand outside and it's 90 degrees out so I don't really want to do that especially because we have to wear a mask all the time when we're in there and it gets hot and sweaty and yeah luckily I used to have to I mean I still am supposed to be wearing an undershirt a long sleeve undershirt with this scrub top because I have tattoos that I need to hide because it's against the dress code and we have to be professional um but with this whole COVID thing, not necessarily that the rules are more lax, but when we were first coming into skills lab, we had to get completely um, done up in PPE. So that was like gown, gloves, hairnet, face shield, shoe covers, the whole nine yards. So I would be putting on a gown to cover my tattoos anyway. So I was like, no one's gonna see it. No one's gonna notice. There's no reason in that back then it was like hundred degrees. We had to sit out and to wait to go into skills lab. So. It's like, I don't wanna wear three layers and be sweating. Like it's literally those gowns, they weren't the like disposable ones. So I'm heading onto campus now. I have to bring a freaking face shield that we have to wear every time we go on. They're flying a drone above here. I don't know what they're doing. Um, but yeah, it's really hot out here, but I'm heading in now, so I have to go. Okay guys, oh my god, my hair looks insane, I'm sweating, you can see it on my face. Whew. Okay, so I just got done with clinicals. Oh, I gotta bless the air. There we go. I was like, why isn't it turning on? Okay, so I just got done with clinicals. I was, let me put you guys back to your designated spot. Oh, yeah. 
exactly what I was not wanting to happen. Um, sorry, my phone just stopped recording randomly. I don't know why. But, it was super fun. I was actually able to get some footage in um, the skills lab, which I'm really grateful for. Oh my god, I don't even know if you guys can hear me actually. Okay, so I just realized, sorry guys, that you guys, <laughs> the audio was really bad with having the air conditioning blasting like that, so I just had to cool down for a minute and then now I can keep it lowered. But yeah, we got to do NG tubes today which was super fun. Actually, I had a lot of fun placing it and I think mine actually looked pretty good if I do say so myself. Um, we just found out today that we no longer have to wear these stupid face shields in uh, skills, which is amazing. That um, was one of the most annoying things to have to do wear. I mean, all the PP was annoying. Um, it's 3.15. I, like I said previously, I still have a bunch of stuff to do at home, homework wise. So I will take some footage doing that. Not too fun though. I just sit on the couch and write and study, take notes, whatever. Um, I'm going to go to Starbucks because I am kind of tired because I didn't get much sleep last night so I think if I want to be productive and get shit done I'm going to need some caffeine so I think that's what I'm going to do yeah I will keep you guys updated on my whereabouts what I'm doing with my life pretty much the rest of this day it's probably not gonna be that exciting um, this video was mostly for skills today I guess because it's the only place I go um, but we'll see I'll see you guys in a little bit I guess okay guys I'm in the Starbucks parking or not parking lot <laughs> I'm in the Starbucks drive-thru right now and it literally smells like straight it smells like poop. Like, I don't even want my Starbucks right now. It smells so bad. It smells like someone literally, like, took shit right outside of the drive-thru right here. And it's, like, so bad. It's, like, so bad. Like, and I'm literally just, like, in a complex. Like, why does it smell like poop? Can someone please tell me why the Starbucks drive-thru smells like poop? Really not appetizing. Okay. I just got home. I just pulled into my apartment complex, but... I'm gonna try this. Never had it. It's the pumpkin cream cold brew. It looks delicious. Oh man, it's not gonna light. That's not good either. It looks so pretty. This is such a bad angle. You guys are getting a nice view of my crotch. Like, do I just like mix it? I don't I don't know. I don't wanna get all cream. Hmm? Nope, that was all cream, but it was delicious. It was really good, okay. I'm gonna go in and then try it for real when I can actually mix it. My pumpkins. <laughs> um, changed into something comfy. We just got a Grove package. Now that I'm all comfy and changed, I'm gonna try this again and mix it. That is so good. It's very sweet though. But I definitely see what all the hype is about. So, now that I'm home, I'm just going to eat some pasta, leftover pasta from last night, and relax for a little bit. I'm gonna watch some YouTube or Netflix or whatever I'm feeling like to um, relax a little bit and then I'm gonna start on more homework. And I have my, my little puppy here. This is Maya. 
<laughs> you really don't. Underbite. And then uh, Karma is also over there. Cat, she's checking out the new box. Okay. Well, I'm gonna enjoy my pasta. And I'll see you guys later.